They also think that the spinning or other movements of the Earth must be trying to fling the oceans off. This is also wrong. The Earth only spins once per day, so the centrifugal force caused by that is very weak. In fact, it is only about 0.3% as strong as Earth's gravity. So gravity easily overcomes that force, and we don't feel it. But we can actually measure it. Objects actually weigh about 0.3% less at the equator than they do at the poles, due to the weak centrifugal force. The Earth's other movements also will not try to pull the oceans off the Earth. The Earth's orbit around the Sun, and the solar system's movement around the Milky Way galaxy, and the galaxy's movement in relation to other galaxies, are all constant, steady movements. There is no acceleration that would cause any problem for the oceans staying stuck to the Earth. Just as you can hold a glass of water in a constantly moving vehicle without spilling it. Everything, including the water, is moving together at the same speed. But speed up, slow down, or turn the vehicle suddenly, and the water will slosh out of the glass. These are all forms of acceleration. The Earth never experiences acceleration, just constant movement. So no ocean sloshing occurs, and gravity has no problem holding the oceans to the Earth.